Hello, my name is Daniel, a certified digital marketer by Google, and I'm here to share with you the three common mistakes that you should avoid when starting or running an online business. So here are the three common mistakes to avoid when starting or running an online business. Number one, social media spamming. Number two, not having clear objectives. And thirdly, not learning the basics. I'm going to take a few moments just to inform you of these three common mistakes and what you need to do to avoid doing these mistakes. So number one, social media spamming. I will say this, stop posting about your business or service on social media all the time. When you come across as a salesperson, people will avoid you, they will block you, they will unfollow you. And these are some of the things that you need to avoid. People go to social media to do basically these things. Have fun, connect with friends, build relationships, get entertained or sometimes even inform people or to get informed. Everything you do on social media should be around these things. Try to be more fun, try to connect with people and build relationships, entertain people and provide information which is useful to people. I suggest you use the 80 20 rule whereby 80 percent of the content that you post should be helpful to others should be entertaining should be engaging and only 20 percent should be content that is about your brand your business or your service to the second uh, mistake not having clear objectives when you don't have clear objectives you end up doing what everyone else is doing and once you do that you don't know what is working, what is not working, what you're working towards. Generally, there are five main objectives that you can try to accomplish when you are online. And these are, you might just uh, want to create awareness about your brand, create engagement, have more followers or likes on your fan page, drive traffic to your website or to your platform, or you might want to convert this traffic to leads and to paying clients. So once you have your objectives laid out clearly, then you can be able to measure and see how well you're progressing towards that goal. An example is this post that was done by Coca-Cola. And clearly you can see it was looking out to get some engagement. And when you talk about engagement, it's about likes, comment and shares. And within three hours, of posting they had received 1536 people liking this post 375 people sharing and you can see several comments also at the back of their mind they are looking about brand awareness and you can see the squirrel holding a coca-cola can number three among the mistake is not learning the basics it is important for you to learn the basics of online business Try to ask yourself, what are the opportunities when I take my business online? Uh, how can I be able to create a effective, an effective online presence? And this is beyond just having a website or a Facebook page. You need to think in details. What online presence do you want to achieve? And at the same time, think about how can I generate sales from my online activities? It is important for you to learn these basics and Google has realized this gap in the market and they have this free digital skills training. I would like to ask you to start this free digital skills training by Google. By doing this course, you'll be able to get the basic digital skills that you need to grow your business or your career or even just have more conf uh, confidence in your online activities. All you need to do is just go to this browser, uh, to your browser and go to this link, bit.ly slash digital skills ke, sign up, complete the 23 topics and unlock every badge. And finally, you will earn the esteemed digital skills for Africa certificate of online proficiency by Google. It is important for you to understand the process through which we learn. Most of the time we start saying that 
I won't do it or I can't do it. And I'm glad that you're watching this video to up to this point because you are at this point. You want to know how to do it. Once you do the course, you will be in a position to know how to do it. Go out there, try it out. At some point you say, I can do it, I will do it and you will become successful in whatever you're doing. So I will bring it up again. The digital skills training by Google get the digital skills you need to grow your business your career or just co your confidence and all you need to do is sign up at this link bit.ly slash digital skills ke go to your browser just type it bit.ly slash digital skills ke sign up for this course it is totally free you complete the 23 topics and unlock every badge and finally you will earn the esteemed digital skills for africa certificate of online proficiency by google thank you very much for watching this video if you would like to contact me you can go to our website which is careerpoint.co.ke or send me an email daniel at careerpoint.co.ke otherwise thank you very much